Ah, hot cocoa, the perfect drink to usher in the holiday season. Is that coffee? It's hot cocoa. It's not coffee. It's not coffee, hot cocoa. What's wrong with you, man? It's November. It's delicious. Come on, man, people like you ruin Christmas. I didn't know. Oh, really? Come on, man, what's next? You're gonna start celebrating New Year's too? You want some fireworks? No, Here. I don't want fireworks. Yeah, is that no, what you no, want, no, huh? You like fireworks, no, huh? No. Is that what you like? No. You like your little fireworks? Hey, no. hey, come on, happy new year, buddy. You no. like the fireworks? No. Ooh, you wanna see the ball drop? Please, Elliot, no, no, no. 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 <laughs> This still there, sweetheart. You got it, baby. There you go. You did it. Matt, welcome to your show, everybody. Uh, is the we camera have on? Malcolm Barrett is here. Oh! He is a delightful friend. He Bit. makes us laugh. We value him as a person. One time now. Uh. Two time now. Uh. My boyfriend and your girlfriend sitting by the fire. Thinking of Fina, I'm not there. Gonna set the world on fire. Talking about hey now. Hey now. Hey now. We do this song come on, come on, every hey. time I'm here. Yeah. We yeah. Hey now. Hey now. Hey now. Hey now. I go, I go on it. This is not. Sitting with Malcolm Barrett. That's not. Sitting with Malcolm Barrett. Sitting with Malcolm Barrett. Up. Welcome to your show from the Valley Folk, everybody. Thank you to all our patrons that help fund this. Show. Uh, this show is uh, happening because of you. You give us prompts, we answer them, we bring guests. It's great, it's fun, and weird, crazy things happen. What do you want to say? Uh, my girlfriend. And your girl. Sitting by the fire, talking about being a fire, and getting to see my fire. Talking about hey now, 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 hey about the well, the, you're implying I just don't. I've never heard that song. <laughs> but you can like, clap I've with never that. even seen you people seen clapping, fall though. into that kind of thing and know it so well, and it creeps me out. That <laughs> I've known you for too long to have never heard that before. Well, that song never made it to Florida. Yeah, I go. I don't care why it happened. <laughs> you guys, I think this is an important question that I don't know if we've ever uh, we've ever tackled. Dane asks, "What do you put on your ideal burger?" Um, I have a specific burger recipe that I like to do where I chop up onions, put it in it, and then I also... You put it in the beef. You I put, put it in, in the, the beef, and meat. then I take a little pocket out of the meat, and I fill it with salt, and I put it in it, and the salt disperses as you're cooking. I think it's like a Tyler Florence recipe. And then on the burger, I put uh, uh, just American cheese. I'm a, just a simple man. Lettuce, not really a tomato person. A little bit of ranch, and then just ketchup and mustard. Just like a nice, simple burger. Nothing. Cr oh, and then I cover the patty before cooking it in both salt and pepper which helps create crust on the outside. Oh, it man. keeps it juicier on the inside. Are you pan frying or are you grilling? What you doing, baby? I grill it, yeah. typically. Yeah, but pan frying yeah, is girl. nice, too. Yeah, it's good. I invite Elliot over whenever I'm hungry for a burger. You guys Juicy Lucy before, right? No. Uh -uh. Andy Milgram, when everyone went to his barbecues, he put the, the cheese in the middle of the oh, burger, yeah. and they would just seep out as it cooks. So you take the ground beef and you put the ooh. cheese in the middle, and then just, ooh. And then when you uh, bite into it, it explodes. And you go, ah. Why do they call it Juicy Lucy? Why? Because it's juicy. And Lucy? Isn't, isn't all the burgers? Talk about juicy. Juicy, juicy, Lucy. I go, I go on it. I mean, I support it. I don't understand what's happening, but I think it's great. <laughs> We can throw up some just like slides or whatever that explain it to people. Yeah, so. that would be a good idea. Kevin, make slides. I know it's a lot for people to. The guy in the back's name is Kevin. I learned it today. That's Kevin. <laughs> All right, uh, last time and the time before. <laughs> <laughs> it's right. not going in semantics. You shouldn't be rude to the editor. Paul Charlton asks, what is your microwave story? What? <laughs> I mean, I get it. I understand. Yeah, yeah like you ever put something you shouldn't have put in the microwave in the microwave? <laughs> no. Something significant okay, so ever happened one with, time, with a microwave? No. You've never microwaved? No. I, what? I put an Arby's sandwich in the foil 
Oh, what the in the microwave when I was a kid, and it just created these like really cool electricity mm. bolts that would like come from the top of the microwave onto the Arby's sandwich, and I was like, whoa! Like like the Terminator yeah, about yeah, to when jump when through it comes time. time yeah. <laughs> just naked. Yeah. Your Arby's sandwich is just naked. <laughs> And it gets we have the beef. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for the Arby sauce. Side note, did you guys feel the earthquake last night? No. I no. Did. Earthquakes are like yeah. nothing here anymore, I feel like. Don't say I that. Like Don't I say never that. I feel them. So it was I felt one for the first time a couple whatever weeks Don't ago. Say whatever. That, that Don't that put that out that there. That one is one where I actually thought about Malcolm, the Malcolm, you put it out and you put it back Malcolm, in. Malcolm, don't put that out Pick there. Pick it up and put it back in. I'm not doing this there, Malcolm. Pick it up, Malcolm. Malcolm, tet it back to tet. You can't put it up and put it back in here to go back in here. Why are you acting weird? Why are you acting weird? You put it back and then you put it back. You put it back and then you put it back. Ayo, ayo! Dude, that no, the one from like a month ago, two months ago, that was the scariest freaking thing down. that I've ever. The way you guys segue is amazing. Do you guys know the wattage of your microwaves? <laughs> no, do you? Uh, no, it's you so know weird. The wattage? It's so weird. Like You're popcorn to... is always like, it's this wattage, this yeah. wattage, and it's like no one knows. Why is popcorn so. the only one that has its own setting on a microwave? Some of them have other ones now. They have like baked potato. Yeah, I've seen that. Baked potatoes? I've seen it, yeah. Mm -hmm. You put a they potato in there instant. and you press the button how did they and come, a baked potato How did they come out? up with that? Was that just the things the microwave could handle or is that like the number one things that like single people were cooking at all? I wonder, I think it might be uh, popcorn came first. Popcorn well, was sort of the, popcorn well, like, was like they the go, fart How they go of... to a potato first? They, they were like, like, here's what this fucking Yeah, it's just something that probably yeah. cooks well in the microwave. Good, good old baked potato. Baked potato. Like, there's burn. also defrosting. 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 No, that's general. That's like and then there's a, a thing, bunch of meat. How long has it been since you microwave defrosted that, in a microwave? I don't microwave. defrost in a microwave. I'll defrost in a microwave, yeah. No, but I don't get that far because it's so it takes so long. It's weird. Yeah. Who's make? You guys make baked potatoes in there? No. No. that sound. Those Christmas carols? Yeah. It's, you know, it's never too early to get into the spirit. Get out of the car. What? <coughs> what are you doing? Hey, hey! People like you ruin Christmas. You just ruined personal property. This car doesn't count as personal property, Joe. You know that. It's like Jumanji. You throw it away, it comes right back. Will you get out of my truck now? Okay, be careful. Thanks, sir. Yeah. No, I just, uh, thank you, man. You right? Yeah, I'm really thankful for you. And I'm gonna reflect on this moment over the upcoming holiday, Thanksgiving. Are you on cocaine? Thanksgiving. Sorry about your radio. Oh, Steve is really interested in telling you now what his buttons on his microwave yeah. say. He <laughs> loves his buttons. Uh, yeah, cause cause Malcolm was so <laughs> mystified by the <laughs> popcorn button, like I was, a damn alien. I was not mystified. I said, how do you think they came up with like popcorn, baked potato? Because like popcorn come up with it? is obviously one of those things where you cook it on the stove I would, and you burn the, it every the time. Question didn't end up popcorn. It went to potato. More like a, you went to, well, because a potato is something easy to more, cook in the microwave. More like a micro, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out. Get out of here. You gotta get the fuck out of here. All right, man. I'll get the fuck out of here. Yeah, and that's our microwave. I bet he's really gonna go home. All right, what are we? What is the theme of what this is? Anything. Just find some a question right. that you like, and I'll let you know if it's been read before. All right, all right. Uh, biggest bodily pet peeve. I can't stand it when people chew. With their mouth open, some don't like to hear people blow their nose, etc. What's your biggest body pet peeve? I feel like you got a number of these. I don't like when my fingernails get too long. It grosses me out. Uh, me too. You, with your own fingernail. Yeah, okay. I hate, no, but also if I see a dude with, I've talked about this a billion times, like unkept fingernails, mm -hmm. and they've just gone too long, and it's like, you should have cut them, but you're not a guitar player. <laughs> <laughs> <Kill him. laughs> 
All right, Taylor Nicole asks, what is a common bucket list thing people do that you don't understand or are too scared to ever do? For me, it's bungee jumping. You Everything. give willingly throwing your body <laughs> off a huge cliff just so a rope can fling you back up and displace all your internal organs temporarily. All the Seems stuff. wild. Oh, I'll never understand the appeal. Everything. Every bit of it. Bungee jumping freaks me out. I just imagine my back breaking. But I would do like skydiving, probably over bungee jumping. I That's... think I've heard that it's safer skydiving. I could be wrong. Really? Yeah. It, you, do, you just made that up? I understand yeah. most of them because most of them are like, oh, I want to live a little bit. That's it. Before I die, Bucking I want to live. So I, none of them have ever like totally messed with me or made me go, why did you want that? Unless somebody was like, you know, I really want to break my legs. Like, I feel like some bucket lists are like, I want to kill a rhino and then yeah, Those I would, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah those I'll are on the list. On that. <laughs> I don't really want Run to. Run with the bulls. Would you do that? No. I'd watch it though. I'd you wouldn't run with the bulls? I'd I'd watch it. it, yeah. I'm thinking about running with the bulls. Really? Really? No, 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 I'm not going to do it, but I was like thinking about like it. Like Chicago. Oh. I was like you thinking about. You were just thinking about, <laughs> about running with the the term running yeah, with yeah, the yeah. bolts. I wasn't gonna do it. Um, I don't like ones that are like I don't know if it's a bucket list thing, but the um, the stuff where you're like I'm gonna do as many shots as possible, or I'm gonna like go out and do like the ultimate party thing. I feel the like I've party. I found I know like my balance of like partying. You know like raging. Like young people are like, I'm gonna go, go like out bar, and bar hopping, or just something, get obliterated. Or? Just, yeah. What do they call it pub crawl, like a pub crawl. Where yeah, when, when people go out and they're like, we're gonna oh, party pub all yeah. night. Pub crawl don't end. But that's not really related. But yeah, I guess I'm just old. You've never done that? No, it's just not something I would want to do now. No, or I, it's not a goal that I have. Like I this feel like I know list? I know how to party, and I like my party zone, <laughs> and that's what I call it. Is my party zone. So you don't look at Bye guys, happy you. Thanksgiving. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Listen, I just want to say something. I am so sorry about all that Christmas stuff, okay? That was way out of line. It's just, I feel like we have so much to be thankful for right now. You know, we have amazing jobs. We get to make people laugh. We're surrounded by beautiful, loving people. And I don't like when gratitude takes a back seat to cheap nostalgia or materialism. You know, it's like, how many holidays do we even think we're going to get? Steve, you're probably going to die soon. Well, look, why? guys, all I want to say is I'm sorry and I hope you can forgive me. Okay? I'm sorry. Come here. Come on, bring it in. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Come here, come okay. here. Okay. Oh my god. I forgive oh. you. There it is. I forgive you. I love oh, you, bud. Thank, Thank you for the great. kisses. Oh, gosh, that was wonderful. All right, now get out of here and go enjoy your Thanksgiving. <laughs> you too, man. Thanks, man. <laughs> you know what? I love you guys. I've never had friends like you in my life, and I'm so grateful for it. I feel the same oh, way. Man. We'll Absolutely. see you guys later. Have a good weekend. Yeah. Have, have a good, good, have good Thanksgiving. Enjoy your turkey. Hey, I will. Hey, you <laughs> Thankful for you guys. I love you guys. God, I love you guys. <laughs> That's cool. He's funny. Joe's really funny. Say it glows. All of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him names. They never let poor Rudolph join in any reindeer game. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say, Rudolph, with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? Then how the reindeer loved him. As they shouted out with glee Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer You'll go down in history I literally went home. He ate an entire Juicy Lucy and came back. I did. I made it and ate it. And came back. And we're still talking about microwaves. Oh, Is everybody God. here okay? 
<laughs> is the carbon monoxide alarm working? <laughs> <laughs> is that you guys? Yeah. It's you guys. It's adorable, right? That's a good picture. Hey. Are you just you. on Instagram? What's happening? No. Hey, it's the oh, he's you guys smushed in like a horizontal ver- Kyle will put the square up. Ka- That's uh, Kevin. Car- Carl-, <laughs> Carl will put the thing up. Because <laughs> 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 he's juicy. Juicy. <laughs> Guys, what song, album, artist are you currently listening to on repeat until you're sick of it? Oh man, that's such a big one. It's, it's so or, I don't know. Right now, I'm not really doing <coughs> albums. I'm on a shuffle kick right now. Uh, 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 oh, you? After you? Here, one, two. Uh, uh, two, uh, two, two. Uh, Europe? Yeah. Okay. Super scissors. <laughs> Super scissors. <laughs> because I knew it was two of you, so I cut that one. It's a chop chop. Cut the chop chop. I got no. I got no. I've been listening to Gold Links. Gold Links. We got. What else we got? Uh, Bootsy Collins. Mm. I've been listening to Old Green Day. I've been listening to Hobo Johnson a lot lately. Oh uh, yeah, he's great. Hobo Johnson's awesome. Typical Story is a song that I'm really enjoying by him. He is like a slam poet. Uh, very deep white boy rap. Really like, like a matcha Yahoo or? Uh, just not the of, same, but just yes. like yeah. Yeah. But he's very fun and creative and I like where his mind goes. And I've also been listening to Bob Seger's Shakedown constantly because I have found that that is the best karaoke song ever. I've been listening to Tom Segoyer. Is that a comic? Tom yeah, Tom Segor. Mm-hmm. Segor. Segura. Tom Segoyer. Sigourney Segura. Weaver. Tom Sigourney oh, Weaver. Yeah. It's some of my favorite alien comedy. Uh, it's alternative alien. Ah, uh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty go. good. Joe, will you f-ing kill Elliot? Yeah, Xeno Jorks. <laughs> so who else? Do you guys have more prompts? I've been listening to Vampire Weekend. Yeah, yeah. Hobo Johnson. Did I say I've been listening to Hobo Johnson? I said something about gold links. You guys listen oh, to Wolfpack? What's Wolfpack? Oh, okay. Yeah. Wolfpack? Mm-hmm. Why are you saying it with a... Because I don't know how else to say it. I think it's Wolfpack. Do you spell it with a doble V? Hey guys, thank you for watching your show. Uh, we appreciate your time. We appreciate your eyeballs. We appreciate your prompts. We appreciate all of it. Um, anyways, if you guys want to be part of it, please consider joining our Patreon at patreon.com slash thevalleyfolk, and you can be part of this show. You'll get a bunch of, uh, content really early. What? Oh, no. Wait, is it really? Is that like the final twitches? Malcolm, you're from Brooklyn and a minority. What if you died like that? Um, here we go, we're gonna do a... Oh, you got him. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna do a... Blah, 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 blah. Tell me when to stop, tell me when to stop. stop. Okay. Um, Chris Crothers uh, says, what is your preferred fruit for consumption? Follow-up question, have you ever eaten a kiwi like an apple? Unpeeled, I recommend it. People hate just the idea of it, which makes it even better, or maybe I'm just a monster. That's insane, Chris. I mean, uh, uh, I'm not opposed, but that's insane. I like it's fuzzy a peach, and that's weird. I like a plum, I like an apple. Peaches are wonderful. What's it doing? Or, I think he's referencing Malcolm, real life. Malcolm, if you need food, we can buy you some. <laughs> oh, um, pomegranate. Yeah, he's got evidence. This is truth. I was eating a pomegranate earlier today. You didn't need to prove it, man. Kevin knew fa- what I was talking about. Because-